Hey there, Sparks. This is Montana Portis with FullTimeSuccess.com, and I had to share something with you, how to break and overcome a poverty mindset. I first shared this on my Instagram. I posted a photo of some of the books that I have on my bookshelf. In May 1997, I was a 19-year-old living in a homeless shelter with my nine-month-old daughter. I knew that something in my life had to change. The people there were content, and I could easily say they were happy. They wondered why I didn't want to stay for the free rent. People ask me all the time how I changed my life, from food stamps, welfare, Section 8. I didn't. God did. I opened up my mind and poured in everything I could to break the cycle of poverty, fear, and lack. I began reading at a very young age because it helped me to escape the reality of the abuse that I was living in while living with my grandmother and her then boyfriend. Reading helped me to think and imagine and believe that I could achieve something better and brighter in my life. Reading brought me peace and love. I loved the adventures and escaping reality. I remember at nine years old reading The Color Purple by Alice Walker. Little did I know that there was more reality and truth in the books I was reading that was true than the false reality that I was living. I was loved by God, even though my mother, my mother and father had left me. The books that you see here are books and authors that have changed my life over the last 16 years. There are books that have helped me realize that I don't have to trade time for money, even though I earn a good income from my career and had worked hard for it. I worked hard to earn my master's after starting with a GED. These books helped me understand that I was conditioned by a false belief. I believed that I had to work until I was 75 to retire and be financially independent. These books helped me to find people that could push me, inspire me, and encourage me to be my absolute best. Like does attract like. If you are struggling in your life, if you know that you have a poverty mindset, you must get books. You have to reprogram your mind. If you're struggling, I want to encourage you to find books that will help you to be the best you that God created you to be. You were not created or designed to live in lack, poverty, or fear. You were created to live in abundance. You were created to prosper. <sighs> Refuse to struggle another day in your life, even if that means you have to escape reality in a book. Do whatever you have to do to reprogram your mind. That will break that poverty mindset, that mentality, and you will overcome. And I especially want to talk to that parent, that mom, that dad that had kids young. I had three kids by the time that I was 27 years old. I had two by the time I was 20 years old. Failure is not an option. It's not an option. It's an excuse, but it's not an option for your life. Look, I believe in you. If no one else has ever told you that they do, I do. I believe in you. So go out and be the hero that God created you to be. Thanks so much as always for watching y'all. I appreciate you so much. And make sure that you share this video. It will definitely encourage and inspire and motivate someone today.